Hey guys, Christina Ritchie. If you want more pars, but you're really struggling out here in the fairway, you can't hit a decent ball, let's make sure you're not moving your head ahead of the ball. And it's really coming from your shoulder, all right? The back shoulder. It's a big culprit. So on the downswing, players are really trying to hit the ball. And they end up doing this kind of action with their shoulder. And look what it does to the head. All right, so if your head gets ahead, you're dead. All right, why are you dead? Because you can't release. All right, so you're gonna blade it or chunk it. And this is a big deal. Once you stabilize, once you move and load into your, your lead glute and really stabilize, you gotta keep that head super quiet so the arms and club can release. That is really important. And you need to swing a little bit out to the right due to the swing plane. All right, players swing this way, you're the target. And so they swing this way, they can't release. They move their head or their trail shoulder too abruptly and they go this way so they can't release. So they end up chunking it or blading it from the fairway. So it's really, really important to keep your head still. All right, so I'm gonna give you a couple cues to help. You ready? Let's get to it. All right, so players really go off. I'm seeing this a ton in my camps. All right, they're trying to hit the ball with the upper body, all right? You're not gonna hit a good ball if you try to hit the ball with your upper body. The only thing you're gonna do is swing into yourself and you're gonna get chicken like this, all right? No good can come from it. Instead, you gotta load up your, your hips and your glute and let that be the driver of the golf swing. All right, and then you stabilize and the club swings almost like a slingshot out to the right, almost like you're throwing your arms out to the right because you've stabilized so well here on the ground that creates a launching pad for the club. Where players go off is they don't load up the lower half and so then they have to manufacture the downswing and that's why they do it because they're looking for the power. All right, so you really got to load up the glute. That's number one, and that's going to help you minimize the trail shoulder action. All right, so I'm going to leave a link for you to watch that video. I cover that in detail, but in a nutshell, we just got to get our trail hip deep and then our lead hip deep. All right, and that creates room here for the club to swing. It creates the leverage with the ground. It helps us to stay in our posture so we can get beautiful extension with the club, all right? That is really, really important. The other cue you can feel, focus on is your trail shoulder. All right, so as you come into the downswing, keep your trail shoulder back. All right, so there's a wall here. You can't break the wall. So you're gonna keep your trail shoulder back and then from this position, you release the club. All right, now you can see you can swing in to out. If your shoulder moves this way, you're toast. The only way you're gonna go is this way. All right, so just focusing on the trail shoulder helps a lot of players. All right, you can focus on your head. All right, even though the head is actually not the true culprit, it's trying to manufacture the power that's the true culprit. It's the trail shoulder moving this way that's moving the head. You can actually focus on your head by putting your head behind the ball. Take your dominant eye and put it right behind the ball and keep it there. All right, keep it there well past impact so you can allow the club to release. All right, if that head gets ahead, yeah, dead. We don't like that. We want to be able to release. We want to get that beautiful extension. We want to be able to stay in our posture because when we swing into ourselves, we actually stand up, which makes matters even worse. So by loading up your lower body, really focusing on the glutes, going deep with the glutes, swinging a little bit out to the right, keeping this trail shoulder back and your head super quiet to allow the club to do what it needs to do which is release. All right, I know what you're gonna ask. Yes, this is for all your clubs. 
all your clubs, including your driver. All right, it makes it real easy.